Hey guys, every once in a while a light comes along and uh, gives me a little bit of a surprise and not always the most dramatic, you know, high performance, um, you know, interesting features lights. This is a very basic little 110 watt light available on Amazon. Most surprising thing about this, how good it is and how cheap it is at the same time. Let's have a closer look. So you cannot get much more basic than this really. It's a little, uh, as I said, 110 watt light, suitable for a two by two. And yeah, very simple, but nicely executed. And uh, not a bad performer as you'll see in a minute. Let's just have a closer look. It's by a company, as I said, called IMV Sincere and they are based on um, Amazon US. And the light is very simple in construction. Quantum board style light. See across here, it's about um, 10 inches by 10 inches, about 25 centimeters by 25 centimeters. Got the driver mounted on the back. This is a driver, I don't recognize the name. It's not hugely important. Um, TBW. TEK, I'm reading it upside down. Um, little 100 watt driver, IP65. Cabling coming out. Um, dimmer mounted on board, which is really neat. I like it a lot. See the um, driver is separated then from the heat sink. So we've got, to, uh, let's keep that driver cool. And there, plastic so you won't get much heat conductivity it's again nice simple hanging mechanism all comes uh, with your hanging ratchets and everything else again nice and simple on the board side we've got uh, multiple cool white LEDs uh, when I say cool white I think that's three and a half K color temperature got 660 nanometer reds there as well and a couple of little um, far red LEDs to 730 nanometers. Board is not coated, but um, again, for this price, not really that critical. As I said, it's a nice little fit and finish, and um, yeah, it does everything you would expect it to do, so quite impressed with it. Interesting thing is, how is it gonna do in the test? So let's find out. So I then tested it in its two by two test area with Mylar reflective walls and used the spot on quantum sensor to take 16 power measurements. Um, the test area, distance from the test area to the um, underside of the light was 10 inches or 25 centimeters, which I found to be optimum. That is giving a maximum dead center measurement of less than a thousand micromoles. And uh, yeah, performed pretty well. So the average power was 578 micromoles across that area. And for the 110 watts consumed, 110.6 watts consumed, and this delivers a system efficiency that is the total power reaching the plant canopy or test area divided by the power consumed was 1.88 micromoles per watt or usable PPF per watt. It's a really, really good result and beats some um, bigger brand LED grow lights of the same sort of power range that I've tested recently that are much, much more expensive. It is not the highest um, quality in terms of specification. However, it's a very good quality finish. It has all the features and functions that you would like or you need um, for a basic um, starter or budget grow light setup or even as a spare light for uh, you know, a seedling tent um, or a clone or mother plant or something like that. It's um, really, really outstanding quality for the price that it is. So congratulations to Sincere, um, a company I know I've done work with in the past and um, have a lot of time for them. And uh, yeah, it is astounding that um, you can get a light of this quality for this price. So congratulations to them. Any questions or comments, please leave them below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Take care.